Hello everyone! Hope you liked my previous lesson about Portuguese symbols. In today's lesson, we will be talking about verbs. Let me tell you one thing. The good way to learn Portuguese is to start learning the verbs. In Portuguese grammar, there are two types of verbs. Regular verb and irregular verb. Let's begin with regular verbs. Around 99% of the verbs in Portuguese are regular. This means that they conform to one of three standard formulas. Number one, the verbs that ends with letter AR. Number two, the verbs that ends with letter ER. And number three, the verbs that ends with the letter IR. Now, let's study some of the examples of regular verbs with its meaning, which will help you to do normal conversation. Now, I am going to pronounce some of the regular verbs with its meaning in English. You can just repeat with me. Sentar to sit, levantar, to stand, lembrar, to remember, falar, to speak, preparar, to be prepare, estudar, to study, comprar, to buy, tomar, to take, perguntar, to ask, Zantar to have dinner, levar to take, apanhar to catch, entregar to submit, colocar to paste, limpar to clean, suzar to make dirty, encomendar to order, buscar. To bring, cantar, to sing, chegar, to arrive, comprar, to buy, ficar, to stay, viver, to live, aprender, to learn, beber, to drink, comer, to eat, escolher. To choose, receiver, to receive, responder, to answer, escrever, to write, vender, to sell, perceber, to understand, esquecer, to forget, repetir, to repeat, partir, to break or to leave, admitir. To admit, dividir, to divide. Now let's talk about irregular verbs. Why it is called as irregular verbs? Let's know something about irregular verbs. Irregular verbs are the verbs that do not follow the normal pattern used in the tense, as in the case with the regular verbs. Instead, they have their own individual way of making tense. Now, I am going to pronounce some of the irregular verbs with its meaning in English. You can just repeat with me. Dar, to give. Ler, to read. Ver, to see. Vir, to come. Ir. To go, ser, to be, it gives permanent meaning. Star, to be, it gives a temporary meaning. Vestir, to wear on. Despir, to wear off. Trazer, to bring. Fazer, to do or to make. Dizer, to say. Dormir, to sleep. Corrigir, to correct, sentir, 
टू फील साइर टू गो आउट सबेर टू नो पुदेर कैन और मे खेर वॉन्ट If you want to learn more please subscribe my channel and share with your friends if you have any confusion and suggestion you can comment me below thank you see you in the next lesson